Now, if you are a teacher and you want to use the more cyber homework system, just follow the instructions I'm going to give you and you'll find it's very simple. So this is how it works. Open your internet browser and type in the more cyber homework address. This will take you to the login page. Click on teachers. If you're accessing the site for the first time, click OK in the window entitled Register for Cyber Homework. Type your name and email address. Please choose a username and password for future access. Now enter a short question which you'll be asked should you forget the password. To confirm that you're using the more course books with your class, select a question related to your course book and type in the correct answer. Then accept the online agreement and click on send. Check your email. You should receive an email confirming your access information. Click on the link in this email. It will activate your access to Cyber Homework. The next step is setting up a class list. Open your internet browser and type in the more Cyber Homework address. Click on Teachers and log in. Click on Cyber Homework, then on Classes. Enter the name of your class in the space next to the plus sign, for example 1A, then click on the plus sign to save it. To add further classes, simply repeat this procedure. Click on the arrow next to the name of your class and assign the class a coursebook, for example More 1. Click OK. Type your students' first and last names into the table. After typing each name, click on the plus sign. Usernames are generated automatically and individual passwords are suggested for each student which you can keep or change. Now you can print out the class list. Provide your students with their usernames and passwords by cutting the printout into strips and handing them out. Please note, your students will need to use the PIN code printed on the outside of the CD-ROM, which they can find in the Cyber Homework version of their course book, to register for the first time. If one or several of your students haven't yet registered on the site using their PIN code, you will see a sign showing a plus and a capital R against their name on the list. OK. Ready. And now you can assign your students their homework. Open your internet browser and type in the more cyber homework address. Click on Teachers and log in under Login for Cyber Homework. Click on Cyber Homework, then on Homework. Click the arrow next to the class you want to assign homework to. Tick the box for the homework you want to assign on the right-hand side of the screen. You can have a look at the contents of the homework before you assign it by clicking on Preview. Click on the Assign button now. You'll see the list of the students in the class as well as the list of the exercises you have assigned. Choose the deadline, the date and time and click on Save. You can print out the information on this page by clicking on the Print button. Click on Back if you want to check the deadline and the status of the assigned homework. The status should be Open. Tell your students they have assigned homework. And now let's have a look at what students have to do. They go to the More Cyber Homework address and click on Students. They enter their username and password. When they log in for the first time, 
they'll have to enter the PIN code printed on the CD-ROM that they can find in the Cyber Homework version in their students' books. They then click on Cyber Homework, where they will find the list of homework assigned to them. Students click on the link for the homework and do the exercises in order. They're free to repeat the homework until the deadline has expired. It's always their last results that are saved. After the deadline for a piece of homework has expired, students can see the corrected exercises and check their scores. Okay, let's assume you want to check how well your students have done their homework. Log on to the More Cyber Homework address, click on Cyber Homework and then on Homework, choose your class and then the homework you assigned, click on Results. You'll see a list of your students' names with their marks. You can print out this list. Click on a student's score to see their results and their errors in more detail. If you click on a student's name, you can see a summary of the student's marks for all the homework done. The More Cyber Homework site also allows you to communicate with your class using the built-in message board. Once you've logged in, click on Messages. Click on the plus button next to create a message for a new subject. Select a class or individual students to receive your message by clicking on the arrow buttons. Tick the box next to Students are not able to read messages of other students if you don't want any communication between your students. Enter a subject and a text for your message and click on OK. Once you've created an initial message, your students and yourself can use the message board as a forum to communicate. Whenever you or your students log on, new messages will appear on the Cyber Homework Start page. It's as easy as that. It saves you a lot of time. And the best thing about the More Cyber Homework system is that your students will love it too.